Hi everyone, my name is Terry and I am making this video for um, the I Am Roses I Do Challenge. It's a chromatic challenge which included only white, beiges, and creams. And the um, theme was wedding or I Do. So this is what I made. It's actually... Um, it's a wall plaque and actually can be used for several different things. Um, as you can see, I have three different things there. So it could be used for um, a picture holder. You could put a picture right here of your engagement or your wedding, um, things of that nature, and put it in a little stand like I've put here. And you can use all three different little slip cards for that. Or you could take this out and this out. And what I made is a do not disturb sign. So it's kind of hard to see, but let me see if you can zoom in here. And it says do not disturb. And it's a do not disturb sign. So when the bride's getting ready in her bridal room, she can hang this on the door. Or after they got married, they could put it on the door as a do not disturb. So that's one way that you could use it. Another way that it could be used um, is with this, you could label your tables. So you could put it as a table decoration um, on the center of a table and you could use it to um, put the name of the table so or the number like I put a zero so this is table zero or it could be table 10 or table 1 or table of love whatever you want to name your table and this could hold your number piece so that's another thing and the third way, like I said, is to hold your pictures. And that's what I did with this one. It's a picture of me and my husband. Um, it's actually our engagement pictures. And I made that like that. And then just put a little bow and a little clip right there on the edge of that. So those are the three ways you can use it. And now let me show you. Um, the project itself, this is a wood plaque that I bought at Michael's. And I painted it with the vanilla paint. And then I used um, a luxury stack paper right here that I bought from Joann's. It's called the luxury stack. It's really pretty and it has a pearlized sheen to it. I don't know if the camera can catch that. And then around the edges, I used a crackle paint, the rock candy crackle paint, so it's really shiny. Um, and then for my I Am Roses products, I have the, um, the leaves here, the skeleton leaves. I have um, cherry blossom here in white. I have some curly roses right here. Sorry. I have another one right here which I broke down to make smaller. Put a pearl in the center and then I have a um, um, a crochet ribbon right here that I got at Michael's. You can kind of see a bit closer. And then I have two other um, curly ribbon rows and another rose right there. And then I put some half back pearls right here and then over here I made um, a lace up and I put some eyelets and they were white but I painted them cream to match and then I tied some seam binding for the bow here and then I put a piece of lace back underneath here and then put that lace where it goes all the way up to the top and then I opened it up and put some more lace to go right here. Another flower, I am Rose's little mini flower. I kind of cut and tore this and put some back, um, flat back pearls. And then along the side, some more flat back pearls. 
all from small biggest to smallest. Some more I am roses, um, small flowers, and small roses. And um, oh my gosh, I forgot what that's called. Anyways, one of those. And so this is my project. I want to show you what it looks like. Lay it down real quick. Kind of zoom in here for you a little bit. So I really, really like the way it came out. I came out, I think, super pretty. Um, I love the way that the this came out different. It's pretty. has lots of different things to it. And then again, the three different ways you could use it. This is just a card. I stamped in the background, put a little letter on it, dinged it up, and put a cherry blossom with a flat back pearl. This one is the, um, sorry, I don't know if it's good. Do Not Disturb. And then I put a little flower in the top and kind of made it messed up. Not messed up, uh, scrunchy on the sides. And then this is a picture, and I used the really pretty um, glittery paper in the background. And then I took a bow out of lace and a little paper clip, paper clip, and a little uh, thing and painted it. And then if you can see here, I don't know if you guys can see this, but it's really pretty. It's the um, paper is uh, glittery. So it's a glittered paper. And then I backed it with another piece of paper. So when it rolled over, you could see the other piece. And then I just did some painting, some crackle painting, some distressing around the edges. So, that's my project. I hope you like it. Um, I don't submit very many videos. This is actually only my second one ever. Um, I'd like to start doing more. So, hopefully you'll see some more of my work. And, um, good luck to everyone. And, thanks for letting me join. Have a great day.